expected shortfall is a risk measure, a concept used in finance to evaluate the market risk or credit risk of a portfolio. It is an alternative to value at risk that is more sensitive to the shape of the loss distribution in the tail of a distribution. The expected shortfall at Q% percent level is the expected return on the portfolio in the worst percent of the cases. Expected shortfall is also called conditional value at risk, average value at risk, and expected tail loss. ES evaluates the value of an investment in a conservative way, focusing on the less profitable outcomes. For high values of it ignores the most profitable but unlikely possibilities, for small values of it focuses on the worst losses. On the other hand, unlike the discounted maximum loss even for lower values of expected shortfall does not consider only the single most catastrophic outcome. A value of often used in practice is 5%. Expected shortfall is a coherent, and moreover a spectral, measure of financial portfolio risk. It requires a quantile level, and is defined to be the expected loss of portfolio value given that a loss is occurring at or below the quantile. Formal definition, if is the payoff of a portfolio at some future time and then we define the expected shortfall as where is the value at risk. This can be equivalently written as where is the lower quantile and is the indicator function. The dual representation is. Where is the set of probability measures which are absolutely continuous to the physical measure such that almost surely. Note that is the Radoni euro nicodem derivative of with respect to. If the underlying distribution for is a continuous distribution then the expected shortfall is equivalent to the tail conditional expectation defined by. Informally, and non-rigorously, this equation amounts to saying in case of losses so severe that they occur only alpha percent of the time, what is our average loss? Expected shortfall can also be written as a distortion risk measure given by the distortion function. Examples, Example 1. If we believe our average loss on the worst 5% of the possible outcomes for our portfolio is 1,000 European euros, then we could say our expected shortfall is 1,000 European euros for the 5% tail. Example 2. Consider a portfolio that will have the following possible values at the end of the period. Now assume that we paid 100 at the beginning of the period for this portfolio. Then the profit in each case is or, from this table let us calculate the expected shortfall for a few values of, to see how these values were calculated, consider the calculation of, the expectation in the worst 5% of cases. These cases belong to row 1 in the profit table, which have a profit of a 100. The expected profit for these cases is a 100. Now consider the calculation of, the expectation in the worst 20 out of 100 cases. These cases are as follows, 10 cases from row 1, and 10 cases from row 2. For row 1 there is a profit of a 100, while for row 2 a profit of a 20. Using the expected value formula we get. Similarly for any value of. We select as many rows starting from the top as are necessary to give a cumulative probability of and then calculate an expectation over those cases. In general the last row selected may not be fully used. As a final example, calculate. This is the expectation over all cases, or. The value at risk is given below for comparison. Properties, the expected shortfall increases as increases. The 100% quantile expected shortfall equals the expected value of the portfolio. For a given portfolio, the expected shortfall is greater than or equal to the value at risk at the same level. Dynamic expected shortfall, the conditional version of the expected shortfall at the time t is defined by. Where. This is not a time consistent risk measure. The time consistent version is given by. Such that. See also, coherent risk measure, value at risk, entropic value at risk, methods of statistical estimation of VAR and ES can be found in Embrett's A. Alan Novak. References, Rook Afler, Arayasov, Optimization of Conditional Value at Risk, 2000. C. A. C. B. and E. Tash, On the Coherence of Expected Shortfall, 2002. Rook Afler, Arayasov. Conditional Value at Risk for General Loss Distributions, 2002. A sub B, Spectral Measures of Risk, 2005. Phi Alpha Optimal Portfolios and Extreme Risk Management, Best of Wilmot, 2008.
2003, CTAC Antoine.